and changing the whole first round complexion? I could be wrong, but I don't think so. Um, let's assume Geno goes six to Cleveland, okay? Where is that next quarterback coming off the board? Okay, there's no needs, right? I mean, you could say you could say the Jets. I don't think they're going to do it, but you could say the Jets. I don't know who you plug in there at eight. I, I, think, I think it's too high for Ryan Nassau. Um, and if Geno's there, I can't imagine Doug Marone has a comfort level after playing against him in the snow in Yankee Stadium that he's going to perform any better in Buffalo. Um, so I see quarterback sliding, and where I see the value picking up is once you get to about 22, 23, 20, you know, Minnesota's got two picks. Would they take one and trade back? Green Bay, do they get stuck? Would they like to come back? You know Belichick at 29 and Baltimore at 32 are always potential trade backs. So I think you're looking in the, the, the final quarter of that first round where a team says, okay, I want a particular guy. I want Manuel, I want Nassib, I want Barkley, and I'm going to go jump ahead of everybody else. And if I do that, I get the five-year contract instead of a four-year contract. Wait, how much is 